Oh boy, I get to phase four, Phil. And oddly enough, someone with 1,400 wins is using kindness. Don't really understand that one. But we have triple decent gear, so we can actually kind of go on par with four, Phil. Golden Pan can heal me. That person has 99 damage and two lives. Golden Pan, I need you to stay alive so you can heal me. Why would you swap that? You nearly saved him. That's fine. This person has narrowly avoided helping Horafell twice, and I don't like that. Well, it's nearly over. GG. Really? This does not look worth playing against at all. I'm gonna be honest. I don't want to face this. Yeah, you can try hitting me, that's fine. So what's the plan? Are you going to let me kill you, or are you going to draw? Or are you going to somehow get me? That's still possible. I don't understand this character yet, so I'm not confident in my abilities. There we go. We've gotten some significant damage on both of them. Alright, both of them have a whole life down now. Let's quickly try to get some minor damage on them. That's fine. And now, I somehow won that. Here we go. I have two golden pans on my team, so this probably is going to be really easy. As long as they both heal me. It's kind of difficult, after all, to use uh, this character and win, considering they're not actually the highest tier of characters. They just have a lot of stamina, which makes it easy for them to hold matches hostage. Golden Pans, come on, I know you have a heal. You definitely have a heal. I don't know why a person in the back isn't healing. Only one golden pan's actually healing, and it's not puppy. That's kind of disappointing. Oatmeal died because puppy wasn't healing. That's pretty unfortunate. Wait, I have no cooldown on my jump. What was that?
Yeah, keep the heels coming and I'll be able to keep walking. GG. And now we continue. This time we're dealing with yet another six bones. What a wonderful character. Definitely not one of my least favorite to play against, not at all. This character is incredibly fun to play against. Everyone loves facing this character. I keep trying to predict it. I'm not doing a good job. Alright, killer. You managed to survive quite a while. Your prize will be me trying to kill six bones before you die. That's unfortunate. And now they're dead. GG. And now we have another match. There we go. And they're below half. I'm still above half. I even have a teammate alive still. Oh no, they got me. How very unfortunate. And they're dead. GG. Another six bones. How wonderful. It appears they are singling out me. Before I pressed record, they even tried to blaster me. Seriously, back off. Oh no, they're trying to butterfly me. If those butterflies catch up, I'm dead. They're ignoring the people who are walking up and trying to get hit by them. In favor of trying to hit the person who's near impossible to hit for a single three damage. That's how much every man does, just three damage. This isn't worth their effort at all, yet they are really trying to push, trying to kill me. There we go. And there we go. Are we gonna face lemon bones? Are we gonna, f oh, we're facing lemon bones. That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. And now, 
we chop them up GG all right I go to press record and they decide to land two axes on me and so the teammates that are here and attacking well, I'm just going to get a ton of free damage on you if you're going to focus on the AFK there. There we go. Perseverance is really weird, I have to say. GG. And now we're playing good old Nega. Yeah, just standing there and taking my attacks isn't going to help you. There we go. Perseverance over there is really low. So they're going to go down real soon. And now pacifist over there is hopefully going to die soon. Oh wait, no, they aren't a pacifist. It's hard to tell when they're playing like that. They're back to trying to kill me. They certainly got my teammate, but... Attacking me this aggressively is kind of annoying. They only attacked my teammate because I was standing on top of them, I think. But who knows? Are we still playing this game, really? Personally, I don't think this game is worth your time. That's an interesting direction to aim your blaster. Most people prefer to aim it at the person they're trying to hit, but everyone has their preference, I suppose. I really don't know what you're trying to accomplish here. Oh wow, five whole damage. Wow, I made a huge mistake by walking to you and beginning to spin around you rather than just walking away. I can feel like I'm going to lose now that I, because I'm not taking you seriously at all. How unfortunate that I'm not taking this character. Dero! It's Dero! Dero! Hello! You all know Dero? It's the other, uh... Don't even remember me. Rude. They, they know who I am, the Discord, but they don't know my Roblox, clearly. I, I, I'm offended. I, I am so offended. Like, sure, their channel is much bigger than mine. But darn it. I, they've talked to me several times to the Discord and know me there. So I'm very offended. Like, seriously, who are you? Wait, they might actually be a different Dero? 
I'm pretty sure... Aren't they the deer? Isn't that the Dero? Am I just crazy? Did I lose my mind on video? I need to check now. Give me a moment. Alright, I double checked. It is indeed the YouTuber. Yeah, but you have teammate. Right? We can do that. I heard that Blueberry got changed. Let's see what the changes are. They lost their little middle blue. That's disappointing. So were they nerfed? Well, I'm just gonna whack them. If they got nerfed, they got nerfed. Yeah, I don't see the changes, to be honest. It looks to just be a straight nerf. But, doesn't really matter in the end. Sorry, buddy. One more and they're down. There we go. And now, we're playing some Negatail. You, you just tritened me while I was talking to my viewers. That's it. Nega Rage Mode. I don't know why I used this Rage thing, considering it's terrible, but I did. Is it terrible? I don't actually know if it does anything besides just give you speed and make things look weird. To be honest, it, I actually think the nega negative thingy negativity looks cool. It's just that this is really weak. You have to use strategies that under swap papyrus, not TS. Regular under swap uses just to make this character work out usually. But it's all good because this fellow is about to meet his end. I said this fellow's about to meet his end. There we go. Goodness, looks like I'm facing someone with a whole 1800 wins. I'm not sure I'll be able to do well against this one. They might be too good for me, you know? Well, one way to find out. Blaster. And now we're gonna get some bones going. We're gonna blaster again. Get some more bones going. more bones, and they're down. Another one down. There we go, there we go, there we go. Only one left. Good old Pan. And how will Pan do anything? Go ahead, try to do something to me, Pam. Wait, are they just running away? No, they're trying to spare me. Gamers, they're going to try to spare. Alright, if they're going to try to spare me. Laster. Yeah, I'd like to remind you that sparing isn't exactly the safest thing to do around here. Might be better for you to just get it over with in combat. But if you want to just run away, you can certainly try to run away. No promises that I will spare you if you run, though. Darn it, they regain health so fast. I'm not quite sure if I can take them down. 
There we go. More damage. I just gotta keep the damage coming. Eventually, if I can overwhelm them, they'll die. Darn it, I didn't get them. And now, more bone- What? They're lagging? What's going on? They're healing, but they aren't taking damage. Oh, they left? That's unfortunate for them. Well, that was fun. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching.